In this video, I'm gonna show you how to delete your voice recordings from your Amazon Echo devices, coming up. What is going on everybody? Welcome back to another tech tip. I hope you all had a great Thanksgiving. I know I did. For the first time in like 10 years, five out of six of our siblings or my siblings, we were able to get together and celebrate for the holiday. Moving on to the video, with all of the different types of gadgets that we're accumulating on a regular basis, from your smartphone to your watch to like the Amazon or even the Google Home Assistant devices, all sorts of information is being taken and pulled from these devices and of course privacy is becoming a big concern. Now it's no secret by now when you do use the Alexa that it saves the recordings on a server somewhere to help increase or help improve the user experience. However, Amazon has made it very easy to go through and delete those recordings from the beginning of time all the way up until the most recent. So in today's video, I'm going to go through and show you how to delete those in two different ways. First being on the Amazon website, we'll go through that process. And then the second going through the Amazon Alexa app on your smartphone to delete the recordings there as well. We're going to be covering both of those in this video, and I'm going to be putting the timestamps down down in the video description if you need to jump and use those as necessary. We will start off today's how-to on the website side of things. So head on over to amazon.com and sign into the same Amazon account that is linked to your Echo device. Once you've loaded amazon.com, you're gonna come up and you're gonna want to just click on where it says your account. Go ahead and left click on that and it's gonna bring you to this new page. Now from here, you're gonna search the middle of the screen right here towards the top. You're gonna look for something that says all things Alexa and left click on that and then it's once again Again, going to bring you to a new page and we're gonna search for where it says Alexa echo devices and your privacy left click on that once more now from here you are gonna want to come up to the top where it says Alexa privacy privacy settings and common questions you're gonna want to select where it says privacy settings what this is going to do is it's going to of course load another page and you're gonna want to select the top option right over here that says review your voice recordings. From here, it's gonna list some settings where it says review your voice history. You can allow you to delete recordings by saying Alexa, delete what I just said, or Alexa, delete everything I said. You can toggle this on and off, but you can also change the date range from today, from yesterday, this week, this month, all history, custom, so it's everything from the beginning of time, you're gonna want to choose all history. So from here, what it's gonna do is it's going to list all of the recordings right below that. And then you can also filter by device if you have multiple Echoes or multiple Alexa devices hooked up, you can filter by each type of device. Now from here, because we are gonna want to delete everything, you can go through and you can select individual boxes as well. Or if you just wanna leave everything unselected and you just wanna wipe everything out at once, just come up here, change the date range to all history, or you're gonna change it to yesterday, whatever method or whatever time frame that you want, and then you're gonna click on delete all recordings for, and then all history is gonna change depending on what you have selected for this month, this week, all history. So we're gonna select that, click delete all recordings. This little message is gonna pop up where it says, when you speak to Alexa, we keep the voice recordings to better understand your voice and your request. We're gonna go ahead and click on yes. It's gonna load a little bit and then it's gonna say no activity. And at this point, you've successfully gone through and you've deleted all of those recordings the time frame that you selected. Now the other option is to go into the Amazon Alexa app and deleting the recordings that way. So first, if you haven't already, either visit the Google Play Store or the App Store and download the Alexa app and then sign into it with the same account that you have your Echo device or your Alexa device linked. Once you've got it downloaded, go ahead and open it up and you're gonna go ahead and want to tap on the three little bars up in the top left-hand corner and come on down and tap on settings. From here in this list, you're gonna look for an option that says Amazon or Alexa privacy, which is usually right down here about midway down the page uh, or about uh, three quarters down the page. Either way, go ahead and tap on Alexa privacy. And then you're gonna search for an option at the very top where it says review voice history and tap on that. From here, you have a bunch of different configurations that you can do while you're in this section is you can review your voice history, of course, review and manage your voice recordings, learn more. You can enable deletion by voice. You can say allows you to delete recordings by saying Alexa, delete what I just said or Alexa, delete everything I said today. However, my experience with that method is it will only allow you to delete everything that you said for that day and you can't actually go back and delete everything from the beginning of time if that's what you're choosing to do. So here comes where the date range will come into play where you can see it says today is selected right here. You can actually tap on this box and you'll have a few different options that you can choose from. You've got today, you've got yesterday, this week, this month, all history and custom. For today's demonstration I'm going to go ahead and choose all history and it's going to go ahead and list all of the recordings that comes from all history in all of your devices. And
and we're gonna tap on where it says delete all recordings for all history. Now, as I was saying, when you speak to Alexa, we keep the voice recordings to better understand your voice and your request. Deleting your voice recordings may degrade your experience while your request is being processed. Uh, the Alexa app may still display the voice recordings you have chosen to delete. Are you sure you want to proceed? So again, Alexa does learn from you, and if you do that, it's going to degrade your experience because it learns from you. So in this case, we're just gonna go ahead and click on yes, and we're gonna get a little circling bar down there at the bottom, and then you're gonna notice all of the recordings have been deleted. Those are the two ways that you can go in and delete the recordings off of the Amazon servers. As of right now, there is no way to do this automatically. And of course, because Alexa does have a learning aspect, that going in and deleting these voice recordings may May actually end up changing your user experience and some of the commands may end up not working like before since it no longer has those recordings or that data to go off of. That is all for today's video. I hope this video was helpful and that you did get something out of it. If you did, be sure to give the video a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. Enable the bell icon if you choose to receive notifications when I upload a new video and we will see you all on the next one.